What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Today you're gonna to be watching the behind the scenes for Junior's Christmas gift to Penelope. So if you guys don't mind, smash the thumbs up button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. Let me know if you have any reaction requests or video ideas, vlog ideas, SML ideas, put them down in the comment section below. I love you guys so much, I'll see you in the next video. Love you all, bye. All right, Cross, today is the last day of school before criminal break. So we are going to have a free day. Oh, so we're gonna have a free day. Okay. All right, Cross, today is the last day of school before Christmas break. So we're gonna have a free day today. All right, okay, can you type Cody's lines you gonna say? Yeah. You spelled break wrong. Okay. Uh, you spelled break wrong. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. That's how you spell break. That's how you spell break. Yeah, okay. No, I didn't. That's how you spell break. I'll make Cody say it's spelled B-R-E-A-K. Okay. It's spelled B-R-E-A-K. Go. No. No. That's break. That's break as if you were to break something. Christmas break is because we are stopping school so you can have a vacation. So cars have brakes that make them stop. So Christmas break means the school stops. Good. That's how you spell break if you broke something. This is how you spell break if something is stopping. Like how a car uses its brakes to stop. This is a Christmas break because we are stopping school for your Christmas vacation. Cody types. That's not true. <laughs> <laughs> that's not correct. It's like, that's not how that works. Okay. That's not how that works, but okay. I'm the teacher, not you. I'm the teacher, not you. You know what? Everyone has homework now. <laughs> you know what? Everyone has homework now. During Christmas break. So nobody wanted to have fun. I'll go prepare a, pa a packet. I'll go prepare a packet. I hate that word, packet. Yeah. It's so yeah. traumatic. That's, yeah, it sounds like there's gonna be a lot. Yeah. Okay. I'm the teacher, Cody, not you. The teacher is always right. But not this time, you're wrong. Okay. Nope, not this time, you're wrong. Shut up, Cody. You know what, that's it. Everyone's gonna have homework during Christmas break. I'm gonna go prepare a packet. Go. All right, Crass, that's it. Since Cody wanna be a smart ass, you're gonna have homework over Christmas break. I'm gonna go prepare a packet. So I'm gonna go, Woo, oh, free day. Heck yeah, dude. Heck yeah, no worries. Uh, you spelled break. Okay. <laughs> go. We got a free day? No word My before. Voice. We got a free day. <clears throat> we got a free day. Yeah. Go. A free day? Nope. Well, damn. Fritos? <clears throat> free day? A free day? Okay. We got a free day? No word before. Oh, that's bad. Yeah. <clears throat> we got a we got a we got a free day. We got a free day. We got a free day. <laughs> oh boy. We got a free day. <laughs> wow. <clears throat> we got we we got a free day. Do you, do you like a siren where you go? Woo, woo, like, 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 warm up your vocals. We got a free day. We got a free day. There you go. Oh my god. We got a free. Damn it. So guys, what do you want to do today? <laughs> Quit smoking. <laughs> Junior to puberty. We got a free day. <laughs> I got you. Good. We got. That's the worst one. <laughs> we got. We got a free day. We got a free day. I'm dead. We got a free day. <laughs> yeah, we got a free day. I want to tell because we got a free day. We got a free day. No work. No, I'm not okay. Yeah, I get that. Good. We got a free day. No work. Oh hell yeah, dude. Uh, you spelled break wrong. Go. Wow, good going, Cody. Wow, good going, Cody. Of course, flipping, you would be the flipping, one to mess it up. You flipping nerd. Flipping nerd. <laughs> yeah, Cody. Sorry, guys. Sorry, guys. Well, I say someone spells something wrong. I, I say somebody spells something wrong. I, I gotta just, ruin everyone's day. I just gotta ruin everyone's day. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what are you gonna do over Christmas break, Penelope? Besides doing a shitload of homework. Besides doing a shitload of homework. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking you could come over to my house and spend Christmas with me. I go, oh, what do you want for Christmas? I haven't got you anything. <laughs> <laughs> well, damn, dude. <laughs> Savage mode. Yeah. It's in, a week. it's in like a week, Jimmy. Stores are still open. <laughs> I really wanted this. I want something so f***ing. What's the name of like a, like a, what's a fake jewelry brand we can make a, like a necklace? Grey Poupon necklace. Grey Poupon. <laughs> Mustard. <laughs> Harry Poupon necklace. Harry Poupon. Harry Poupon. What's Harry Poupon? Poupon. Harry Poupon. It's like the most name brand necklace. It's like the most expensive name brand necklace. Harry Poupon. <laughs> Cause like every name brand so bullshit. Like the you know what I hate? I hate Louis Vuitton and Lou Vuitton. Yeah, they need to sue each other. They need to sue each other. Those are different things. Yeah. I, yeah. Yeah. I no. just found that out. That's like crazy. Is that let me do? I it's bullshit. It's it's bullshit. It I thought the, I same. thought the They're shoes were the same. Larry Vuitton. Louis Vuitton, Larry Vuitton. <laughs> <laughs> Larry Vuitton. And so I always felt like I was saying one of like one yeah. of them wrong because I was like, yeah. oh, Louis is it Louis Vuitton, Vuitton or is it Louis Vuitton? I want a Larry Vuitton necklace. Larry Vuitton. Yeah. <laughs> Larry Vuitton. Say, well, I don't want to seem like a gold digging bitch, but. 
But I really want this Harry Poop. But I really want this Harry Poop on necklace. Harry Poop. <laughs> Harry Poop. <laughs> what the hell? Oh, who you are? Think asking for that? Who the hell you are? Ask my dog for that. Yeah, asking my dog for that. What's a Harry Poop on? Jimmy, you've never heard. Jimmy, you've never heard of Harry Poop on. <laughs> like the most name brand. The most name, name brand expensive. Name brand expensive show off neck show off necklace <laughs> that you could get. You could get for a girl. For a girl. Yeah, Lil Wayne did said he's richer than a bitch without the Harry Poop on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's true. It's true. Little Wayne owns a lot of Harry Poop on. Little Wayne owns a lot of Harry Poop on merchandise. <laughs> merchandise. <laughs> <laughs> oh, necklace. Necklaces. And go, Junior, it's the only thing I want, please. Junior, it's the only thing I want, please. Well, how much is it? Well, let me put it in well, let funky me put rap it terms. In funky rap terms. Hip hop. It, funky hip hop terms. It'd be about a band or two. Shit, it'd be about a Shit, band. Shit, it'd be about a band or two. <laughs> Sounds about right. <laughs> One to two thousand dollars? What, what if her asking that? From a child. Yeah. You don't have to get it for me. You don't have to get it for me. Oh, really? <laughs> There's no <doubting> about it. <laughs> Harry poop on. It's just the only thing that would make me happy. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I will think about it. Hey, yay! Oh my god, you love me! <laughs> I freaking hate you, Cody, you freaking fricker. I want to frick your mom, frick. <laughs> Everybody. <laughs> frick your mom. Good going, Four Eyes! Yeah, you flippin' nerd! Sorry, guys. Whenever someone makes a spelling mistake, I have to just keep pushing and pushing until it ruins everyone's day. I frickin' hate you, Cody, you frickin' fricker. I wanna frick your mom. Hmm. So, Penelope, what do you wanna do during Christmas break? Other than a shit ton of homework? Sorry, eat! Well, Junior, I was really hoping we could spend time together on Christmas Day. Oh, well, do you, like, want a Christmas gift or something? Because I haven't got you anything. Yeah, I want a Christmas present. I got you something! Junior, Christmas is in less than a week. Well, the stores are still open, so I can go get your gift today. What do you want? I really want something, but it's really expensive. What is it? A Harry Poupon necklace! Harry Poupon! What the fuck? You meant my neck? Rich Rich? What's a Harry Poupon necklace? Junior, Harry Poupon is the most name brand show off expensive necklace there is. All the white girls want one. Yep. Well, how expensive is it? Well, in funky rap terms, shit, a bad band or two. Sounds about right. Lil Wayne did say I'm richer than a bitch without the Harry Poupon. Yeah, he did say that. Lil Wayne does love Harry Poupon necklaces. Mm -hmm. One to two thousand dollars for a necklace? You don't have to get it for me, but I really want it. And, and think about this, Junior. If you got me something like that, I could like never break up with you. Because what other boyfriend could get me something like that? Hmm, I mean, you could never break up with me if I got it for you. It's like an investment. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, this is so much homework. Joseph, where's your Don't homework, Pat? Those are the rest of the black. <laughs> <laughs> where's the rest of your homework, Joseph? Get shit away. I'm not doing homework on Christmas break. True. We gotta look up these Harry Poop on that. Gene, you're not actually gonna get her Dude, one. You're not actually gonna get her one. Oh, I just want to look and see how, see what they look like. Oh my God, they're all like two thousand. These are some of these are these are four thousand. I told you, Junior Harry Poupon is the shit. Literally. <laughs> I told you, Junior Harry Poupon is the shit. Literally. And I'm like, well, that one's nine hundred thirty. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's affordable. Dude, so, you can't even see that shit. I don't even know if she'd accept it. <laughs> Dude, she's not gonna accept that. You need to get one of the bigger ones. You gotta get one of the bigger ones. And go, all right guys, maybe I can do the $2,600 one. Junior, where are you getting this? <laughs> Junior, where are you getting that money? Okay, so here's what I was thinking. I was thinking I could take my dad's credit card and get grounded. But I can get my dad's credit card, I could order the necklace and then give it to her. And then hopefully my dad won't find out till after. And then I'll own Penelope and then... <laughs> <laughs> own her. You're not gonna own her just because you bought her in next She year. said that she'll never leave me. <laughs> Junior, that, of course she can still of leave. Of course she can still leave me <coughs> and do whatever she wants. But she said if I bought her, she would never leave me. Junior, she can say anything she wants. She can say anything. <laughs> Doesn't mean it's true. Doesn't mean it's true. Okay, when I give her the necklace, I'll tr she has to sign a contract that she's mine. I don't think she's going to go for that. Also, I think Abraham Lincoln stopped that. <laughs> <laughs> I think Abraham Lincoln stopped that kind of thing. He might have a point. So you're telling me if I give her this necklace, I don't own her. No. No. I mean, but still, I, I should still get her this necklace. No, Junior. You can tell her that you're a kid. You can tell her you're a kid and you can't afford that, which you can't. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I can still take my dad's credit card. But before I do something so stupid, I need to make sure she's loyal first. Okay. <laughs> like, I don't want to spend this much money on a girl. Because, like, they, imagine I buy this necklace for her, and then she cheats on me. That's, right. yeah, so what I think I should do is I think I should hire a guy, a hot guy, to go ask her out. I'll ask for her number. If she gives her number, she's a cheating bitch, I break up with her. I like the plan, dude. At least you're thinking about this a little bit. <laughs>
<laughs> what if she just gives the guy a number to give him to go away? So what if she just gives the guy a number to give him to go away? That's cheating. It's over. Mm -hmm. She should say, I have a boyfriend. Go away. What if she gives him a fake number? Uh, nope. I have a boyfriend. Go away. <laughs> Scram. That's the only answer. Yeah. The fact that you gave her a fake number, you, you entertain you him. Inter yeah. He's going to think you gave a, uh, you, act, you messed her number up. And that's when he sees you in public. Oh, you remember that time you gave me that number? It didn't go through. He could really probably guess the other number. She yeah. might have just knocked one number off. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> The only acceptable answer, Cody, is I have a boyfriend go away. <laughs> Why is that so hard? <laughs> Why is that hard? Like, literally, that's so hard. <laughs> maybe she's just trying to be polite. Nope. <laughs> maybe, maybe she's worried that she's gonna, like, stalk her. Nope, a loyal girl would say, I have a boyfriend go away, you chump. I don't think this is fair to Penelope. Yeah, I don't think this is fair to Penelope. <laughs> well, how is it not fair? If she does it, she's unloyal. It seems like she has to say a very specific sentence for you to be happy with how this goes. Yes, <laughs> she does. <laughs> Because if a girl came up to me and asked for my number, I would say I have a girlfriend. No, you wouldn't. <laughs> but that, we're dudes. We're dogs. <laughs> we're just trying to get our next bone. Yeah. Like, we're hunters. It's in our nature to smash, you know? For women, though, like, they need to be loyal. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all right, bro. Hey, man, bro. You can't expect to toss a bone at a dog and we don't hump it. Yeah. <laughs> we don't go after it. Yeah. <laughs> Come on now. We're men, right? Women are supposed to be nice and polite and loyal. Mm -hmm. Men, we ravage and pillage. Man. Oh, man. I'm doing it wrong. Pillage. <laughs> I wasn't even fully hard. That's not cheating. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't like it. It's not cheating. <laughs> oh my god. I, I felt bad after. How about that? How generous. <laughs> <laughs> You're right. You are a good person. <laughs> <laughs> like afterwards, I was like, I didn't even want to do it. <laughs> oh man, poor you. That must have been so hard for you. I'm so sorry. It sucked. Okay. <laughs> Go. Man, this homework packet is huge. Joseph, where's your ham ha homework? <laughs> the ham can. Go. Oh man, this is so much homework. Cody, where's your? I'm uh, over here. <laughs> <yeah>. <laughs> where's your homework packet? Pack packet. Come on. Where's your homework? <laughs> homework. <laughs> Where's your packet, dude? Yeah, packet, yeah. I'm not doing homework before Christmas. I'm already on Christmas break. True. I'm gonna look at these. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna look at these hairy poopon necklaces. Junior, you're not actually gonna buy one of those, are you? This is just a JPEG. <laughs> <laughs> Good. Ugh, that's so much homework. Thanks, Cody. Sorry. I threw my shit away, dude. I'm not doing homework on Christmas. I'm already on Christmas break. You're right. I'm gonna look at these hairy poop-on necklaces. Ah, oh, Junior, you're not actually gonna buy one of those, are you? I might get her one of the cheap ones. Like, look, this one's only $930. Dude, you can't see that pebble. It's so small. She's not gonna like that. Well, how about I get her the $2,500 one? How are you gonna even afford that? I was thinking I could steal my dad's credit card and buy the necklace, and hopefully he doesn't see the charge until after I give her the necklace. But, but by that time, she'll be my property. Junior, you're not gonna own her just because you bought her a necklace. She said if I buy her this necklace, she'll never leave me. Dude, she's not an indentured servant. Yeah, she can say anything. It doesn't mean it's true. True, she could still leave you. Well, I'll tell her, look, I'll only give you this necklace if you sign this contract saying I own you. Okay, well, even if she agreed to do that, it's not legal to own a person. Well, what stupid idiot would make that rule? Abraham Lincoln. Why'd he do that? <clears throat> oh! Yeah, I guess he made a good decision. I, I guess? What do you mean? I guess we just guess it now? Look, let's just go back to the hairy poop on. So if I buy her this necklace, it would be stupid because she could just leave me anyway? Yes. Okay, so then I should test her loyalty before I spend so much money on a Christmas gift. What, how are you gonna do that? I'll hire a really hot guy to ask Penelope for her number, and if she gives her number, she's a cheating bitch, and I won't give her the necklace. Ooh, I like this plan, dude. I don't know, this doesn't seem fair to Penelope. Not fair! If she gives her number, she's a cheater. If she says, I have a boyfriend, then she's loyal. What's not fair about it? Well, what if she gives him a fake number? That's still cheating, because it's, uh, you're entertaining it. Yeah, of yeah. course. If she gives the guy a fake number, the guy might think she made a mistake and said, ooh, she got a number wrong, she really was into me, she saw my, my wiener imprint in my pants, and she liked it. Yeah. Yeah. That doesn't seem like cheating to me. If a girl asked me for my number, I would say, I have a girlfriend, I'm loyal, go away. Because that's my boy, he loyal. Mm -hmm. Junior, you would not say that. Well, that's because we're dogs. You know, we're just trying to get our next bone. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, if a girl asks for our number, we're going to say yes, especially if it's a 10 out of 10 Coke bottle shaped ass busting out the frames type bitch. Well, that's why it doesn't seem fair to Penelope, because you're getting a 10 out of 10 guy to ask her. Well, girls should stay loyal, Cody. So, so I think I should do this. I'm going to hire a really hot guy to see if she'll give her number away. Okay, well, who are you going to hire? Oh, dude, I know this really hot guy. That's my best friend, Stanley. Oh, he has a bunch of hoes. He got like seven on his roster right now. Oh, bro, I should definitely call him up. Is he hot? Oh, yeah, dude. He f***s. He f***s a lot. <laughs> he keeps his f*** wet. Oh, man. Ah, yeah. fuck, 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 fuck. I'm not doing the whole thing. Yeah, okay. oh, shit, shit. I forgot what, how he I don't like he f***s. He f***s a lot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he f***s a lot. He f***s a lot. This kid f***s. 
a lot. Cause I'm gonna say too much. <laughs> it's a problem. <laughs> Oh, dude, I know the perfect guy. My homeboy Stanley. Man, he pulls all the hoes. He has seven on his roster right now. Is he hot? Bro, he f***s. Keeps his wet. I'm telling you, smooth as butter. Real player made ass. Look, we went to a party one time, and I had this girl. She was 11 out of 10, bro. She was really feeling me. Hot as hell. But then I walked away to get a drink. Next thing you know, she's upstairs with Stanley getting it on. You can't leave him alone with a girl for longer than 30 seconds, bro. Yeah, he picks pockets. That sleight of hand, bro. Oh, juggernaut. Bro, he has every perk available. Wait, why have I never heard of this guy? Because he likes vagina, Cody, not penis. Look, I'm going to get it real quick. Uh, Junior, aren't you a little worried about Stanley? He seems a little overqualified for this job. He might actually steal your girlfriend. Well, that's what I want. I want a guy so hot that she would cheat so I know not to buy her this necklace. But I don't think it's just going to be a job for him. <laughs> All right, we need Stanley. <laughs>